Have you ever wondered where all those cars, machinery, and fancy electronics come from? Well, for Germany, a major player in the global economy, the answer used to be China. But in a surprising turn of events, the US has recently taken the crown as Germany's biggest trading partner. So what's behind this shift? Buckle up because we're about to dive into the fascinating world of international trade. A changing landscape It all started with a perfect handshake. In the early 2000s, China was an economic powerhouse on the rise. Their factories churned out everything from toys to televisions at breakneck speed and incredibly low cost. Germany, on the other hand, was a champion of high-quality machinery and precision engineering. It was a match made in trade heaven. For years, German luxury cars and industrial robots rolled off the assembly lines and straight onto ships bound for China's booming cities. The Chinese people, with their newfound wealth, craved these symbols of German quality. It was a win-win situation. German factories hummed with activity, creating jobs and boosting the economy. Chinese consumers got access to the best technology the world had to offer. But fast forward a decade and the cracks began to show. China's breakneck growth started to slow. They weren't just buying German goods anymore, they were learning to make them themselves. Chinese factories began producing increasingly sophisticated products and their own brands started to gain recognition. The demand for German exports started to dip. On top of that, political tensions started to simmer between China and some Western countries, including Germany. Concerns about intellectual property theft and human rights issues began to cast a shadow over the once rosy relationship. German businesses started to look elsewhere for trade opportunities and that's when the U.S. stepped in. The American Advantage Across the Atlantic, the American economy was experiencing a resurgence. Uncle Sam, after a period of sluggish growth, was flexing its muscles again. The housing market had recovered. Consumer confidence was high, and American wallets were feeling a bit heavier. This newfound spending power created a surge in demand for all sorts of goods, including the very ones Germany excelled at producing. German cars, known for their sleek designs and powerful engines, found eager buyers in American showrooms. American companies, looking to upgrade their manufacturing processes, snapped up German machinery and industrial robots. Suddenly, German exports to the US were booming. But it wasn't just about American spending. The U.S. government, under pressure to diversify trade partnerships and lessen reliance in China, actively encouraged closer economic ties with Germany. Trade deals were negotiated, tariffs were lowered, and red tape was cut. This created a smoother, more efficient flow of goods between the two economic giants. The timing couldn't have been better for Germany. With China's demand softening, the U.S. stepped in as a hungry customer ready to gobble up German exports. This unexpected turn of events not only helped the German economy, but also served as a strategic win for the US, giving them a foothold in a crucial European market. The Geopolitical Implications This trade shift between Germany and the US wasn't just about buying and selling widgets. It was a story playing out in a much bigger stage, the stage of global power dynamics. For decades, the U.S. had been the undisputed leader of the free world, but China's meteoric rise challenged that dominance. The U.S.-China trade war was just one symptom of this growing rivalry. Germany, caught in the middle, found itself increasingly uncomfortable with its reliance on China. Issues like intellectual property theft and accusations of unfair trade practices by China made German businesses wary. The human rights situation in China also raised concerns, making German consumers feel uneasy about supporting Chinese products. On the other hand, the US, with its long-standing alliance with Germany, presented a more reliable and familiar trading partner. Shared democratic values and a commitment to human rights created a foundation of trust that was lacking in the China-Germany relationship. So the US overtaking China as Germany's top trading partner wasn't just an economic move. It was a subtle shift in Germany's geopolitical stance. By strengthening ties with the US, Germany 
could lessen its dependence on China and perhaps even act as a bridge between the two economic superpowers. However, it's important to remember that Germany still has significant economic ties with China. After all, China remains a massive market with a huge consumer base. Germany can't afford to completely sever its economic relationship with Asian giant. The future, then, seems to hold a delicate balancing act for Germany, reaping the benefits of a strong U.S. partnership while maintaining a workable economic relationship with China. The Future of Trade The world of international trade is anything but predictable. The war in Ukraine has thrown a wrench into carefully constructed supply chains, causing disruptions and delays. Countries are rethinking the reliance on single sources for critical materials and goods. This could create both challenges and opportunities for the US-Germany trade partnership. On the one hand, these disruptions could make it more difficult for both US and German businesses to get the materials they need to manufacture their products. Shipping costs could rise further, impacting consumer prices. However, this uncertainty could also be a catalyst for collaboration. Imagine a future where the US and Germany join forces to develop new technologies and production methods. The US, with its expertise in areas like artificial intelligence and software development, could collaborate with Germany, a leader in green energy solutions and advanced manufacturing to create a more sustainable and efficient global trade system. For example, they could work together in developing cleaner and more efficient shipping methods or invest in renewable energy sources to power factories. This type of collaboration could not only benefit their own economies, but also set a new standard for responsible and sustainable trade practices on a global scale. The future of US-Germany trade remains unwritten. Challenges abound, but so do exciting possibilities. By working together, these two economic powerhouses have the potential to not only navigate the current uncertainties, but also shape a more secure and sustainable future for global trade. Why should you care? This whole trade shuffle between Germany, China, and the US might seem like a distant game played by big corporations and government officials, but the truth is, it touches our lives in surprising ways. Think about the new phone you just bought. The chances are, it might have German-designed components assembled in China. Or maybe you're in the market for a new car. German and American automakers are constantly competing, driving innovation, and hopefully leading to safer, more fuel-efficient vehicles. The price of everyday goods can also be influenced by these trade dynamics. If tariffs are imposed on certain products like clothing or electronics, you might see those costs passed on to you at the checkout counter. On the other hand, strong trade partnerships can sometimes lead to lower prices due to increased competition. Even the job market in your own community can be affected. If a local factory relies heavily on exporting parts to Germany, a shift in trade partners could mean new opportunities or even job losses. International trade is a complex web, but understanding its basic principles can help you see how it connects to your own life. By staying informed about these global developments, you can make more conscious choices as a consumer and even advocate for trade policies that benefit your community and the environment. Share your thoughts in the comments below, and if you like this video, click the next one shown on the screen. Thanks for watching!